What to what to what up everybody? It's Crazy Al Kane. We're here at the 2010 King of New York competition is going down. As y'all know that um, I have this hip hop BMX contest that I'm trying to do. I'm trying to get some heads in the hip hop industry. You know what I'm saying? Doing the doing that thing. To hop on some BMX bikes and race around the track. You know, when we went to Delaware last year, me and me and C Truth went to Delaware last year, and he was talking about how he wanted to race and everything. And I was like, all right. And then he finally hit me this year, like, yeah, I want to race. So that's how I came up with this whole idea for this, B this hip hop BMX challenge. We also have Mike Geronimo say he's down to do the race. We got um, Eric Beasley from Asylum Records says so he's down for the race. And um, my dude Jomo Davis right here, Ready. representing BET right here. Yeah, yeah. Thank you, sir. Yeah, Jomo Davis, I guess it'll go right here, lower third. Jomo Davis, BET. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Jomo Davis, BET, the lower third. Okay. Yeah, segment producer, the deal, BET. Just coming out here to represent. I understand Mike Geronimo is supposed to get his thing going, Eric Beasley, a couple other cats. You know, I'm just ready to, to go in. I'm, I'm not trying to get beat, by the way. You know, that's, that's how we do. So, uh, you know, I'm about to get on the bike here, do a couple of the jumps. Al Kane's, I'm sure, showing you all the, all the ramps. Got my thing in a little earlier as well. A couple skip marks on my knees. Skip marks, pause on that, I guess, right? Skip mark, that's not right. That's not quite the, uh, the nomenclature. Just say cuts, cuts and bruises. Cuts and bruises, there it is, cuts and bruises. <laughs> we, we, also, we also have C Troop over here. He's, a, he's in full gear, pretty much. He's riding 20. Uh, we, we're gonna get him on a cruiser, though, for the actual race, but... Uh, yeah, get a close-up on the, on, the, uh, on the elbow pads and whatnot, yeah, yeah, man. Yeah, get a, yeah, get a, yeah. a close-up on the elbow pads. See, my man is serious right now. You know what I yeah, mean? Gotta, gotta make sure that everything is safe. Cause you know I'm not a professional BMXer like Crazy Al Kane and the rest of cats that check out CAC TV, but you know I'm doing it for the sport, doing it for the fun of it. I got a chance to see the whole BMX movement up close and personal last year, going around with CAC TV. So you know I figure I give it a whirl, give it a try. It's a lot of fun, so we gonna get it going. Yeah, yeah. Let's be clear. I mean, he does have all the, the gear on right now, but he hasn't gone above three miles per hour. Let's just, just be clear about that. Well, I got, I got, the, I got the semi gear on. I don't have my full, full gear yet. So like, you gonna be out here looking like RoboCop. You are gonna see me at the race with the full gear on. Okay. I, I'm, the, I'm just semi right now. I'm civilian right now. Okay. Okay. I'm just doing a little cruising around, just a little something, something. You know. What kind of preparation have you guys done so far? Have you ridden BMX before? Do you ride bicycles? Have you been doing sprints and pedaling and stuff like that? What's going on? <laughs> up, we, we have another challenger. We have another challenger for the BMX, uh, the hip hop BMX challenge. My boy Raw, he's a, a producer, hip hop producer, uh, photographer, and he used to ride BMX. I mean, you know, he doesn't really ride that much now, but I, I would say he has a little edge on you guys because he does have a, a background in BMX. So I was asking the guys, I said, what kind of training and, and practice have these guys been doing? We're going to start with Jomo first. Well, I've been in the dojo, you know, so I, I'm ready to get, get busy. Snicker bars. Corn pops, you know what I mean? It's, it's the real food, you know what I'm saying? So I'll, I'll be ready. Yeah, honey nut Cheerios, peanut butter and honey sandwiches on, whole grain bread. There it is. Um, toe ups, a lot of toe ups. You know, you gotta keep the calf muscles strong. Right, 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 let me see, let me see. You know, just like that, just, you know, 100 a day. Right, right, right. <laughs> Looking a little intimidating. You know? Right? <laughs> Looking a little intimidating. <laughs> you know, so um, uh, cardiovascular, we have to work on that though. You guys might have me, I don't know what kind of cardiovascular training you're working on, but you know, I gotta get, you know, up on the jump, jumping jacks or something. Perhaps you'd like to talk about your regimen, sir. <laughs> yeah, well, you know, I've been doing a lot of radio, thermal sound waves and all that, thermalsoundwaves.com. That definitely helps you prepare and get your mental right. And then on the physical situation, they do a lot of stair work, a lot of walking up the stairs to broken elevators in New York City. So that helps work the legs out. And then, you know, doing some push-ups here and there and whatnot, and a lot of chocolate cake. A lot of apple pies as well, you know, that, that gets the whole, you got to build your carbohydrates up. Right, right, right. So I get all that in the system, so then I'll be ready, you know what I mean? Alright, y'all going to have to do a lot more than that, but if y'all all doing the same type of training regimen, it, it might be a fair enough race anyway. So, um, Jimmy Mack from Bulldog Bikes is here. We're going to try and get uh, some of his bikes to, uh, to, to be the bikes you guys ride for the race. Um, we're also trying to hook up with uh, Judd over there at uh, Hyper Bikes to get you guys a, a Hyper Cruiser. Um, but we have, um, we have him here today, Jimmy Mack, we're going to kick it with him real quick. So hold on a sec, I'm going to see if I can get him and his cruiser over here and, and get you guys on there and ride around. So hold on. <laughs> 